any top flight across the world, whatever league you play in, whatever nation you represent, I think it's important that throughout your career you, you aspire to play at that top level and I think it's one thing getting there. Um, the biggest challenge is how long you can stay there. Never won a league, being in WSL 1, it's a very tough league as well, so to finally get my hands on a trophy would be amazing. Some of the kids do look up to you a wee bit and they think, you know, like, oh, I really can actually go and, go and play. And this year, with us being promoted and playing in the top league, you know, I've had quite a few comments, like, on social media. It's maybe encouraged a lot more girls to go into, get into the game and, and play football, and um, I'm totally here for that. Playing against some of the top players, players that I would, you know, sit and watch on the TV, and, you know, when you turn up to the game and you realise you're playing against them, it can be quite surreal. But, um, yeah, I think there's no better challenge than to be testing yourself against these top players and that's the, that's the way I'm going to keep improving myself. So. Yeah, definitely. I'm very proud to also play in the top leagues and for Colmarnock. It's a great club, so playing every week for them is just it's ideal. For me, any time I wear the Hibs crest, I wear it with, with pride and regardless of if it's a, a league game, cup game, win or, or not, I, I certainly wear the, the crest with pride. If I can do that in the build up to a, a league campaign win, then, then certainly it would, would, mean, would mean a lot to me and would mean a lot to the group. To be able to push and play now in one of the top leagues in Scotland is I am really proud of as a team, as a club and as a like as a player. Like that's something that I can take now with me throughout the rest of my life. To going full professional and then last season we were competitive. Um, so this season obviously there's a bunch of expectation, but you kind of just have to forget about that and you're doing it for the girls you're playing with. And I think it would be awesome to just be able to say we were the first fully professional team at Rangers specifically to uh, win the league, that would be great.